Now we're just 23 days away from the first soccer match at the first stadium ever built for a professional women's sports team. But your parking spot outside of CPKC Stadium may cost you more than your seat inside. The team just released this map today. General parking will be limited to three lots outside the stadium and only one of them is paved. Now the price to park this season is $50. That does not include taxes or fees. KCTV 5's Mark Palos joins us live now from outside that stadium. Mark, I know you spoke to a few current fans. Are they suffering a little sticker shock from this? Carol, and they certainly are. Everyone that we talked to thought that $50 price tag for parking was a lot higher than what they expected. However, uh, the current do have some fans that really do enjoy this team and what they stand for, and they are willing to pay that price. But still, others have some questions they want to answer before they fork over $50 to park. The first one is, how long will this gravel lot make a gravel lot? $50 it seems a little steep. I wonder if they're going to pave it. <laughs> That's a big question there. The KC Current's price tag for parking raised eyebrows of sports fans across the metro. It seems a little steep. The Current will play 13 games at home this season. Do the math. If you park at every one of them, that's $650 plus taxes and fees just to park. When you're paying $50, so you got a family and you got you know, you want to buy their hot dogs and your, your uh, concession stands and it's just it's a little steep. While some fans think the parking fee is high, some others are willing to pay. If it's going to generate more revenue for the team and for the city at large, then I support it. People pay that much for American football tickets and things like that. I don't know why we wouldn't pay it to go see such an incredible team of really, really talented athletes. The cost of parking also has fans looking at alternate ways of transportation, including rideshare to get to the games. I can't wait to go to the game. I'll pay the $50 to go to the game, but it'd be for me really almost I don't live that far away. It almost be cheaper to take a lift ride. If you don't want to pay that $50, you can easily park somewhere and still be able to get there. You can park in so many different lots for a lot cheaper and take the streetcar down here or walk down here. Now, it should be noted that streetcar extension here to CPKC Stadium is not scheduled to be completed until next year. Now, we also did reach out to the team to find out if the teal and green lots are going to be paved, that, that, if that's in their long-term plans. We have reached out, and we are still waiting to hear back. For now, reporting live outside CPKC Stadium, Mark Paolo's KCTV 5 News. Interesting developments, Mark. Thank you.